Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, this is Sam and good evening, uh, today is January 30 of 2020 it's a Thursday evening and I just want to show you uh, an update of the growing uh, flower spike of my Celeriana orchid and I purchased this plant around July last year and it was a seedling and it has grown a little bit bigger this time in comparison the first time I purchased this plant it has grown so well and super healthy in the method where I'm growing my plant as you can see the plant is <coughs> growing in a spherical um, glass vase and the media that I use for this plant um, is uh, I use charcoal and a uh, lava rock for the media for this plant and the last time I showed this plant was about I think it was two months ago like around November last year and the spike was just a little speck there at the base and now it has grown long and the flower buds are starting to show and it has a secondary spike right there with I think two flower buds and on the main spike it has one two three four five six seven I'm seeing seven uh, buds that are forming right now and it is a super healthy plant at the moment. Hopefully it will stay healthy. <laughs> and I'm super happy because uh, it's my first time to have an species orchid under my care and I was able to have it spike. And this plant, um, I water this about every two weeks. And I'll show you next time what I used and how I watered this plant. And behind the plant is a hybrid plant. A Phalaenopsis hybrid that I don't know. It has no ID. And next to them are my other two species of orchid. This is a Falcolipinensis that I purchased from orchid.com and oh this one is orchid web and this is orchids.com and uh, this is the very first fowl species that I got last year around February together with my Sanderiana but I got this with a flower spike but it did not spike this year and another Celeriana, it's a TKP, that's the tag name for this one, and uh, it's growing good too as well. So let me go back to my featured orchid for today. It's a Celeriana orchid that is spiking and budding right now. And it's growing super healthy. And look at those leaves. Uh, they are silvery <laughs> and mottled. So, alright, guys, I'll get back to you again and give you an update as soon as the flowers will open. And probably take about another month. Hopefully, it will not take that long before the buds will <clears throat> um, open and mature and hopefully it will be soon alright guys before I go I just want to show you some of the phalaenopsis that I have under my care that is blooming now and it's pretty flowering Phalaenopsis right there and another one it 
it has two flower spikes. The spurter, the first one that I was showing you was a secondary spike from last year's main spike, and four of them has opened. And another major spike with few buds that will open in few weeks. And the last one that I have right there. This is a white um, Phalaenopsis, and it's the first time blooming for me. Okay, let's move on to the other side. Okay. Look at my dendrobium. Four, four of the flowers are already opened. This one is also blooming for me for the first time. And look at those healthy leaves. It's beautiful and healthy and it's growing in hydroponics I use Leica beads for that so thank you guys for watching and let's go to my featured orchid one more time I'm super happy for the progress of this one so thank you guys for watching, have a blessed and restful Thursday night, bye!